Krishna. Good afternoon, sir. First of all, tell me, Krishna, uh, about your basic details. I mean, uh, from where have you completed your B Tech? Sir, I have. I uh, I am completing my B Tech in Andhra University College of Engineering, which is in Visakhapatnam. Okay, Visakhapatnam. You are still about to complete. Yeah, I am still about to complete. I am in my second semester of the fourth year. Sir. You are in which semester? Second, fourth, fourth to sir. Okay, right now you are in fourth uh, semester. Ah, uh-huh, not sir. Fourth year, second semester. Ah, the fourth year, second semester. Okay. Yeah, so yeah. Your yeah. degree will be completed in. I think sir in May, May twenty five at that time. May twenty May or June mostly in this yeah. year only, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This year only. Sir. Okay, okay. I thought you are in second year, so I was <laughs> surprised. So okay. Uh, see, uh, I'll I'll ask you one question. See, uh, many of my students, um, when they are in their third year, yeah, or sometimes in final year also, uh, they enroll in uh, for preparing uh, gate chemical engineering examination. Due to many reasons, they are not able to continue their preparation. Okay. Uh, uh, my, I mean, it can be uh, sometimes there are college fests. Sometimes there are, uh, you know, uh, sometimes there is uh, uh, college training going on, college placements going on. A lot of activities are there when you are inside the college. Oh, yeah, sir. Yes. So how you manage all those things? Sir, by God's grace, I have uh, I have faced two two lockdowns, no, sir. That's why I don't have to go to college. Um, okay. My class almost all always in online only. That's mm-hmm. why I can I think I can manage that. Okay, so uh, we can say that okay, due to this lockdown uh, and all these scenarios, okay. So due to those scenarios, uh, you are able to prepare, right? Yeah, sir. If I am in college, I think I can't get that rank. It it, will, it would have been difficult in that case. Yeah, yeah, sir. It would been difficult for me. Okay, fine, fine. So right. So how many hours you devoted for studying? And what was your uh, pro- like uh, like routine for preparing the uh, subjects? Sir, I think I have devoted for about four to five hours in a day, sir. Mm-hmm. Sir, my schedule starts like this. I wake up at six a.m. in the morning. After mm-hmm. completing my daily activities, uh, uh, I go through the aptitude problems for a, for an hour. After so that, aptitude. Yeah, yeah. Daily. Uh, yeah, sir. Daily, sir. Because. Uh, okay. When I wrote gate exam before, I think in 2021. Before going in, before going into this, tell me one thing. Uh, when did you start your preparation? Sir, I started my preparation in uh, I think in three one semester, sir. Hmm? Third year, first semester. Third year, first semester. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, okay, this is a very important thing that uh, you have to start early, right? Yeah, sir. Yeah, sir. Your time of <laughs> when you started your preparation, it was you are saying third year, first semester. Means I think during the lockdown, sir. During the lockdown, sir. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Sir. But still, you started at a very good point of time, right? Yeah, sir. I say that. Okay. So all the students who are watching this video, please listen carefully. That if you want to score very good rank, it is very important that don't wait for final year or the last few months for preparing gate examination. I think Krishna, I'm right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It is the right time to start the coaching. You started in the uh, fifth semester. Yes, sir. And okay. So, didn't you uh, think about preparing from yourself? I mean, many students say that, sir, I want to do self preparation, like from books or from YouTube lectures or from other free lectures are there. Sir, we can prepare self study after a uh, one year of coaching. Uh, I thought I thought that because we we don't we don't take coaching. Uh, then we can't clarify our doubts our, ourselves, no sir. We must have a guide to clarify our doubts. So you think that clarifying doubts is easier with the help of, uh, I mean, proper guidance is? Ah, yeah, yeah, proper guidance is. Okay, and once you have done proper coaching, I mean, complete coaching. Yes. Then thereafter, even if you are not able to score a very good rank, you can do self preparation after that. Yeah, yeah, sir. Okay. we can do uh, by analyzing our previous mistakes in our previous examination so we can go forward with our plan and do, do self study okay because see what i think krishna that uh, right now you are competing with all those students who are also undergoing through uh, you know uh, through online coaching or through offline coaching or whatever they are also preparing right yeah yeah so if we want to compete with them 
Okay. Then even for us, coaching becomes uh, you know very important in that case. Yeah, yeah, sir, yes. Yeah, because I know some students they have uh, scored very well by self preparation also, but that percentage is very low, one or two percent only you can say. Yeah, sir, yeah, sir, yeah, sir. So uh, uh, from where you uh, got reference of I mean uh, my lectures? Sir, I didn't. I at the time of starting of my preparation, my friends are also. does not uh, join for the gate coaching mm-hmm. i just go through the youtube youtube videos so that mm-hmm. i came uh, i came across of your lecture sir okay then, then with the help of my seniors they said that uh, sir this deepak pandey sir will teach you properly and they he will guide you properly okay so uh, you started your preparation in fifth semester yeah. first of all what was your target i mean what what thought that i have to do this first sir i started uh, this preparation because of my parents only sir first of all i didn't have an interest in this gate after starting and listening to your lectures i thought that maybe i can gain some knowledge from this and i can give a give this test oh, what is your current cgpa i mean when you when you started preparation or right now what is cgpa i it's all same sir my cgpa stands at 8.9 i think so 8.9 yeah okay that's good okay fine right so uh, from which subject you started your preparation sir i started my preparation from heat transfer which is a, obviously an easy subject to start okay heat transfer you started because it's an easy subject yeah yeah normally i ask my student to go through process calculations first <laughs> so wh- what was your best subject during the entire course of preparation which subject so my, was favorite there are three four subjects sir first of all my first preference is heat transfer okay then mass transfer but many of my uh, friends are saying that mass transfer is a tough subject but uh, after going through your lectures i think that it is a very subject why are they telling me like this and discourage me to uh, opt for other subjects actually see uh, i have i have uh, discussed this with many students they say that sir my this friend has said that this subject is difficult yeah. or my that friend has said that you want to be able to crack exam so whenever you listen these things now the people who are saying this thing they have actually never prepared i mean okay they might have joined a coaching they might have taken some lectures right but they, they have, they have not devoted themselves actually in the preparation yes sir yes sir agar aap ek bar padh loge na if you have really if you have watched my lectures the complete lectures which we are providing right now at ingenious platform you go through those lectures If you are really interested in uh, preparing for the gate examination or understanding the subject, you won't find it difficult. Definitely not. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right. So, uh, Krishna, like uh, when you started your preparation, first of all, you completed the gate, uh, the syllabus, the lectures, or you jumped into the questions directly. No, sir. I first, I first complete all the syllabus. Then I go to the previous year papers for the after the. Um, um, the previous papers are also solved by me after the one revision of that subject only sir okay, after so completing you complete one subject yeah one subject and i will revise it for a week or two weeks then i will go through to the papers sir papers and then that subject is kept aside that is complete yes, ah yes sir but then there comes a very important questions which most of the student face that when we go through one subject we revise it also we solve the questions also then we keep it aside and uh, we move to the next subject yes after some time definitely it's very natural that you are going to forget the previous i can't remember all of this but i repeatedly uh, memorize all those formulas uh, and uh, every day and night uh, for one hour in a night sir so no what was your uh, i mean uh, entire plan for managing this problem like uh, to revise the uh, to uh, Uh, go through the new subject and at the same time to manage the previous one also what was your uh, plan sir my plan was that we have uh, we can't go through all, all the lectures for 4 uh, to 5 hours a day sir mm-hmm. but uh, so i thought that we if we complete two lectures a day mm. then we can complete uh, about in 15 days or uh, or 16 17 days or 3 weeks mm-hmm. maximum mm-hmm. Uh, so that i i make the plan according to that sir Mm-hmm. then first of all on that day i co- i completed all the lectures which i have been assigned myself to see that mm-hmm. after that uh, i will go through the um, notes i have uh, written uh, during that lecture so that i can uh, understand the subject in a complete sense 
Okay. After so, that I in the this I mean uh, how much time you took uh, approximately to complete the entire syllabus? Sir almost 7 uh, to 8 months sir. 7 to 8 months. Yes, sir. And this is very important. You were like uh, you were having plenty of time because uh, colleges were ah, not yes, there. Sir. Still, it took seven to eight months to properly cover yes, and sir. then revise yes, and sir. solve the gate problems. Gate problems. So, at some point of time in uh, during the preparation, did you feel like uh, uh, I am feeling like I don't know anything, I don't remember anything, like two or three subjects? They, I'm. Did you feel like blank during the course of preparation? Sometimes. Mm, yes sir sometimes it will happen sir but uh, at the time i will go through the notes i have written and i will read it for uh, almost a one or two days so that i can uh, memorize all the formulas okay and uh, okay suppose uh, okay throughout this after this uh, your syllabus was completed uh, after that uh, what was your next step sir at the time at the completion of at the time of completion of my all subjects the gate exam has came sir gate 2021 examination okay uh, i thought that uh, uh, with these concepts and uh, with these formulas we can write the gate exam uh, so i i practiced the uh, previous year question papers uh, with um, i mean by keeping a time of 3 hours okay then after that i go to the exam sir i got a rank of 630 rank in gate okay, 20 you got already you got 630 rank in 20 yeah, yeah, sir. okay that's already a very decent rank in uh, i mean in a third year if you are getting 630 rank that's very decent yes sir yes. and so i think you must have felt motivated after getting this rank no, sir i thought that i can gain 200 rank uh, with that knowledge sir but uh, uh, that 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 most of the student feel this thing that okay i could have done this yeah yeah because sir. you ha- you already had knowledge but maybe due to uh, wrong way of attempting the examination yeah, yes, sir, yes. and examination fear you uh, got only 630 rank okay yes, so sir. did you analyze your mistakes after 21 exam yes sir yes sir i think oh, for a month i feel depressed sir uh, i can do this but i can't do it i know all these formulas but i can't do it mm-hmm. then i after a one month uh, Uh, then after the gate exam, I have my semester examination, sir. So I okay. I go to the college and write my semester examinations. Mm. And after completion of my semester examinations, I got I come to the home and I analyzed my mistakes, sir. I thought that if we practice well, if we practice with the test series, and if we if we can manage the time which was given by the gate gate authority. then i think i we can crack the gate examination sir with this for for the first time i think you did not practice test no sir i did not practice at all i practiced you were not having time you were busy in uh, completing the syllabus yes sir but sir. in the second time i think you practiced the test series very well yeah, yes sir yes sir i and test series can you tell me like how the test series is going to help you like uh, if you have done the concepts how the test series is going to help sir test series will help us to analyze at at what part of the subject we are feeling low and at yeah. part of, at what part of subject we are feeling high okay so that we can go through that part and we can uh, re re read it uh, through the standard and test and through the when did you like uh, start giving the tests i think i start giving test series in mid october sir i think mid of october october again again see the timing of everything is very uh, right in your case right because yes, if my students uh, if they remember i told them that first november is the i mean the maximum date up to which you can extend your test series right yes, i told them that if you are not able to complete the syllabus then take the month of august september even october you can take but it should not be more than or later or delayed than first november Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So November, December, January, and you started in mid October again. That is good. Fine. So how many tests you were giving? What was the frequency of tests? Sir, uh, I have given almost uh, all tests, all tests, sir. But uh, during the January month, I can't given my tests because I have the semester examination at the okay. You have, January. Okay. You were also having the exams. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hmm. And again, that uh, postponing of the gate examination also. Uh, no now i told all the students because this postpone uh, postponing of the exam this news came just before i think four or five days before the yes, exam yes sir yes sir it it is actually a negative thing for 
I mean, uh, if it is coming at this point of time, like four or five days before the exam, this is not yes, a good thing. Yes, sir. Uh, if it is coming the month of December that it, the exam may be postponed, then it's okay because ah, yes, sir, yes, sir. before the four or five days, each and every hours is very crucial. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And yes. if you are uh, suppose the student is uh, thinking about okay, the exam will be postponed. Uh, let's do that. Let's do this. Let's vote there. Let's sign there. Something <laughs> is going to happen. They are wasting yes, time, sir. right? It's okay. all so see now those students i'll tell you because many of my students they kept keep saying that sir uh, we have our semester exams in january how we are going to prepare yes sir now if all of you you can see yourself this guy is there in front of you and he started early that's why he was managed he was able to manage the syllabus he started giving the test series early from the month of october so that by the end of december i think you have uh, uh, given most of the tests. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I have given you are free in January. You can give semester examination and do a little bit of revisions. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, uh, uh, apart from semester examination, uh, how you manage the gate syllabus in the month of January? Sir, in January, I almost completed all the tests of uh, test series, sir. Okay. Uh, some tests are yet to become hmm. in that month. So I think that uh, uh, I have my semester examination, I think from 27th of January. So I think that uh, from starting of January, I started re rewriting the previous year papers with the time allotment. And I mean, mm. in three years of the time, in th I mean, three, three hours of the time. Okay. I re started rewriting the previous year papers so that uh, we can gain confidence, sir. In that month, if, if we lose confidence in that month, we can't write the gate examination, sir. Definitely. That month is very, very important. Yes, sir. Previous, uh, year but, papers, previous year papers will give you your confidence so that we can go and write the gate examination. So I yes, thought sir. that... From your journey, like one point is very much crucial. Like if you have to manage two things, yes, sir. you have to manage your uh, college schedule, college syllabus, and apart from gate, if you have to manage two things, whether you are in B.Tech, whether you are in M.Tech, whether you are in job. Yes, sir. And along with this, you want to appear for gate. It yes, is sir. very important that you start at right time. Yes, sir. Because suppose if Krishna thinks of starting uh, preparing gate examination in his final year, maybe he has to take a drop. Right. Because yes, it's difficult to manage two things together. Yes, sir. Some of my friends are uh, thinking of uh, taking a year of drop and write a gate okay. exam. If they are thinking of taking a year drop, just tell them about engineers. Yes, tell them about Deepak Pandey, sir. That I you have to go there. Yes, sir. Study I all the concepts. Go through all the concepts. And uh, your results are definitely, if you are hard working, if you are dedicated students, then definitely it will show in the results. Yes, sir. I suggest them the engineers platform and do your lectures, sir. And and your about, uh, uh, what you will say about our test series? Sir, the level, the test series very, is very good, sir. The mm -hmm. level in which the test series is given is similar to the level which is given in the gate examination, sir. So mm -hmm. I thought that, but many of my friends suggested another test series, but I thought that uh, Deepak, uh, Deepak, I believe in you, sir. I mm -hmm. believe in your test series. So I thought that, uh, so go through the test series and write mm -hmm. that. So, uh, see, actually what happens that I think many of your uh, friends yes, sir. Uh, might have uh, discussed with you that yes, the test series is very difficult yeah. and we are not getting marks in the test series. Yes, right? sir. In ingenious test series, they are not getting marks. Yes, the sir. same thing happened in the examination also. Ah, yes, sir. So, w what was your feeling when you uh, saw the paper for the first time? Because definitely the paper was difficult. I will not say that it was easy. Even my all all of my students who were in the top 20 in uh, our uh, you know in our test series, uh, I asked them that how many marks they are getting. Most of them are getting someone is 55, 56, right? And my top 20 students they always lie in top 100 in uh, gate examination. I okay. know that. So okay. that's why I knew that if you are getting 55, 56, you will be definitely in the top 100 marks, top 100 rank. So yes. what was your feeling when you saw the paper for the first time? Sir, first when I go through the aptitude section, I thought that this paper was very easy, similar to the 2017 gate paper. Why you started with aptitude? Sir, I make a plan before going to the gate examination, sir. Sir, I thought that if we completed aptitude section in 15 to 20 minutes at max, then uh, remaining one hour 40, uh, I mean two hour 40 minutes, we can contribute all that time to the uh, technical part section, sir, which is very crucial and which is a deciding factor also. 
definitely technical is deciding yes yeah yeah uh, if uh, some of the question in gate examinations uh, all the questions cannot be repeated no sir some of the new questions will be appear for that uh, new questions we can give some more time so i thought that if we completed the aptitude section in 20 minutes uh, and the remaining time will be contributed to all those section okay so when you saw the technical portions because many of my students they uh, discussed after the paper that's sir when i saw the question like what what i told the students that you have to look for 20 25 easy problems which can be attempted in the first yes, go sir. Yes sir, yes sir. Right, and thereafter you have to look for other ones. Yes sir. So like they said that sir, we were able to solve twelve or thirteen questions in the first go, and thereafter when we saw the questions, we were like uh, in too much pressure, in too much panic that uh, I'm not able to solve the problem. So uh, you also face this kind of situation or not? Sir, no sir. First of all, I am in a safe place sir because I got placed in Reliance Industries sir. Okay again. Okay, you have also. <laughs> Okay, you you are also placed in Reliance Industries again. Okay, that's yes, very good. Okay, I got placed so that I think. Oh, okay. Let's go through the exam. Don't be panic. You, if the exam doesn't go well, you have no, you have a job in your hands, no. Hmm. So I thought that go go through the paper. Don't be panic. If anything questions appear tough to you, leave it and go to the next question. That should be the strategy, but. actually there is a actually this happens with everyone even if i am sitting in the examination this will happen with me if i am not able to solve a problem i'll feel like uh, i am very good at this subject how i am not able to solve the problem this is a very common feeling but at the same time you should also be very practical that yes. each and every question carries same marks and mm-hmm. time is the thing which is going to decide your rank yes sir yes sir okay fine so uh, that was uh, i mean very good that you are also you also grabbed the offer at college and you are getting very beautiful rank this time so suppose uh, uh, if you are getting a psu selection and you have reliance offer also what will be your final decision sir i will obviously go to psu sir you will obviously go to psu right okay but uh, okay fine that's uh, i hope that you will be definitely uh, getting one or two or maybe more than that job offers this time right and uh, let's hope that uh, uh, your journey for uh, getting into a psu becomes easier with us so because you have to also uh, you know you have to also uh, uh, go through the interview preparation okay sir. because uh, the psu like if you are looking for bar for iocl for ongc yes, each and every psu interview is also very important Yes, sir. Interesting. And uh, I am going to be with you. Sunil sir will be with uh, uh, all of our faculty team will be with you in this preparation journey. And Thanks. soon we will also start this uh, interview preparation part. Thank you, sir. Thank okay. you. Okay. So good luck from our side, and thank you so much for taking out time for this discussion. Not a problem. And sir. right. So Krishna, okay, that was a very good meeting, and definitely you stay in touch. and if in case any inquiry or any uh, help is required from our side let us know okay sir okay okay, okay. thank you so much krishna thank you so much thank you sir thank you